about this fire, quite unfortunate a tragedy. It is started at uh, about 3 a.m. early this morning when our officers received that information. Uh, and uh, one thing that I would like to say is that uh, we had very good people, particularly the youth, who responded positively and promptly to put out the fire, despite the fact that uh, before the engines arrived, the youth had uh, done quite commendable work. Although you have heard that uh, we had problems of accessibility. In fact, the fire engines, when they came or arrived, they had very good, they had very bad challenges of accessing in order to put out the fire. Otherwise, uh, we are informed, and that's very reliable information that we are invested about what exactly uh, caused the fire. Is about a certain stall whereby our officers received information that that fire started from that stall. We are withholding that information as at now. That one will form a basis of investigation. As at now, we haven't received any information about fatality, but uh, we are still gathering more information whether we have, any, we have any fatality or any injuries. But after the fire has been put out, definitely we will team up and uh, ensure that our officers go there searching for any anything that we can be able to, to see whereby we can even set in life. But as now, it is true that we have never heard in Nairobi such kind of tragedy in respect of fire. I can say categorically that uh, the response in respect of city, uh, city county, fire engines, the personalities, they responded very positively. They came, five, five, five fire engines emerging, responding positively. But one thing that I would like to warn Nairobians, particularly in former settlement, and also those people who live there, please cooperate. Because any fire engine coming to respond to emergency, they need positive and, and prompt cooperation. Because we had some challenges in respect of people trying to talk very bad language to drivers, saying, where were you when this fire started? Please, that is not good. We need to cooperate. We need to, to ensure that we have free flow of information and also accessibility. Otherwise, we have arrested some people who tried to, to loot. They are our police stations with the loot. That's very bad. When we have such a tragedy, we have some criminals trying to take advantage, looting while we are, some people are crying. So they will face the law. Otherwise, that's a warning that we need to come up together so that we see that any tragedy that we encounter, we face it wholeheartedly, not having some people taking advantage and looting, spree being encountered. Thank you. Like how many? How many have been arrested? As of now, we have six in custody with their wares. So I would like to request anybody who, of course, might have uh, anywhere lost. We still have those suspects in custody with the wear. Please come over so that we can be able to identify the loot. Thank you.